hello guys welcome to my channel today we are going to see how to fix a display resolution grayed out in windows 10 or windows 11 let's fix it guys method one you just need to go to search menu and type a device manager click on open it in device manager you just need to expand the display adapter section and right click on where graphics card driver and select update driver select search automatically for drivers and select search for updated drivers on windows update Select check for updates and if you have any pending update listed over here then you just need to update it and make your operating system up to date guys. After getting you are up to date just close off here and go ahead and restart your PC. After restarting your PC you can check if the problem solved or not. Method 2 you just need to go to search menu and type device manager click on open it. Expand the display adapter section right click on the graphics card driver and select update driver. Select browse my computer for drivers and select let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. In this list you just need to select your graphics card model guys and then select next. After getting update done you just need to close stuff here and check if the problem solved or not. Method 3 you just need to go to search menu and type device manager click on open it. You just need to expand the display adapter section right click on where graphics card driver and select uninstall and select uninstall again and uninstall the driver after uninstalling the driver select action tab and select a scan for hardware changes and now you just need to close stuff here and go ahead and restart your pc after restarting your pc you can check if the problem solved or not Method 4 you just need to go to search menu and type settings click on open it. On left side you just need to scroll down and select windows update. On right side scroll down and select advanced options. You just need to scroll down and under additional options select optional updates. And if you have any driver update listed over here then you just need to expand like this and then Check mark the driver listed under the driver update and then select the download and install option and it will be started downloading. You just need to wait for this downloading to get complete. After getting done you can check if the problem solved or not. Method 5 you just need to go to search menu and type cmd. Right click on the command prompt and select run as administrator and select yes. Now you just need to check my video description for these command used in my video. Just to copy and paste it and press enter. We just need to wait for this command to get 100% complete. After getting 100% complete, you just need to close stuff here and go ahead and restart your PC. After restarting your PC, you can check if the problem solved or not. I hope one of these methods fixed your problem. If the video helped you, don't forget to leave a like guys. You can also subscribe me and support me guys. Thank you.